Good afternoon. Welcome to the Art Money Talk. My name is Mo. Valentine's Day is just around the corner. Perhaps you are thinking about shopping some gifts for your boyfriend, girlfriend, partners, beloved ones, or even just a family member, friends. You want to use this opportunity to cheer them up. And if they are artists, do not miss this video. We're going to talk about different gift ideas for artists. I saw this post on Reddit. Someone is looking for a gift for his girlfriend who is an emerging artist and he was very excited to spend this birthday and make it special for her and it was very nice of him and I was like so touched. So I followed this post and I thought it would be a good idea to make a video on in general gifts, not only for Valentine's and birthdays, perhaps also works for New Year, Christmas or any other special occasion. So today we're going to talk about different gift ideas of wide range really depending on your budget. So the first idea usually people think when you gift a gift to an artist usually is fine art material, fine art supplies. It's definitely a good idea. However, if you are not an artist, be careful because very likely you buy something she or he doesn't like. They need a specific material to match their techniques, the medium, their style. So it's not you walk into the fine art material store and grab the nearest gift set. That doesn't work really for artists like especially professional artists. For example, I grabbed this set um, from a fan art store. It's the Water Soluble Oil Pastel. It's a new thing and I didn't have it before when I was young. So I thought, oh, it's a water soluble oil pastel. How does it work? I was just curious and it was like recommended in the in the gift section. So I was like, oh, nice. I'll, I'll buy it and try. But guess what? Because they're so special, um, I couldn't use it to do anything serious. I, I just have it sitting around on my shelf collecting dust and it's a pity to not be able to use it. And uh, very likely if you just gave a random something and she will not um, be able to use it for her work. If you really insist on getting something art related, then perhaps it's a good idea just to get a gift card and she or he could pick up some materials she likes in the future when she passes by. So uh, it's, it's one of the idea. However, just giving a gift card perhaps is showing that you didn't spend enough time. You're not thoughtful enough. And it's just like some kind of gift you have to give. So let's see what else can we get. Perhaps gadgets. Uh, if you're techie, gadgets would be a good idea. For example, uh, Apple Pen. Pen Apple? I don't know, um, you know, the, the, the pen that works with a tablet. But again, if you're not sure if she's using um, a particular uh, tablet, maybe she's using a Wacom or she's using a Samsung and you're not sure, then it's a good idea just to get like a generic gadget that doesn't pick certain uh, operation system, for example, a tripod, some lights, so she could take better photos of her art. That's also a very good idea. Again, gadgets doesn't last a very long time. If you want something that lasts very long and doesn't ever go out of date, it will be um, books. I like receiving books as gifts because I can always keep it uh, on my shelf. And whenever I see this book and I thought of my friend, and I do feel the connection that the book is connecting me with my friends. And this can last a lifetime and perhaps it can outlast you, her, or your relationships. Besides all of these things, uh, more and more people are gifting experiences instead of material things because new generations like millennials, they would love to spend more money on buying experiences instead of objects because you know their homes are full of things and every day they have to de declutter their things and minimalists are like trending now because we have too many things. So if you don't want to cluster her home but you want to give something memorable then good idea to gift like a museum ticket, maybe get of two tickets so you can accompany her to the upcoming show or for example you can buy her uh, digital courses like uh, marketing your art course or like on Udemy some courses are really cheap but if you want to give her some special perhaps some consulting sessions with art consultant however they are not cheap it can go up to $400 per hour and if you don't have that kind of money don't worry here I have a secret weapon if you want to build a very close bond between you and your friend and perhaps develop uh, further into a romantic relationship, here is your opportunity. My secret weapon is buy her a domain address. Why domain address or web address or domain name, whatever you call it, you know, this 3w.something.com. 
60% um, of emerging artists we surveyed in our community don't have a website. They also don't have domain names. So buying them a domain name would be like a door opener of a new world of communicating your art online is an excellent idea because once you gift her the domain name which only cost $9.99 for the first year, $11.99 for the second year, you can you know choose to renew it or maybe she can take care of it herself. Now this is something to think about next year, perhaps next Valentine's Day. You can just renew the plan for her as a gift. Once you give her this domain name, she would like to have a website likely because you know everything's ready to make a website then what you can do is to brainstorm the website idea with her and work on this common projects together and you are creating a lot of opportunities to work on something together you see you're spending time together doing things together and you're like you know going on the same direction together so this is a perfect way to build a future together so this is my secret weapon if you are thinking of developing this friendship into a relationship or relationship into a lifelong relationship i would say this is definitely the go-to gift and only cost under ten dollars why not so that's all for today i hope i have helped you finding the perfect gift for your friend and for your partners loved ones and hopefully you will rock it this valentine's day okay thank you very much for watching see you in the next video